going to discuss concrete and abstract. What are concrete nouns? Anything that you can see, touch, smell, taste, hear is concrete. Concrete nouns actually refers to objects that we can experience with our five senses. That is by seeing, by smelling, hearing, tasting and touching. Examples. A mountain can be seen. Incense sticks can be smelled. A trumpet can be heard. Yummy. <laughs> noodles can be tasted. I really love noodles. Yeah. So noodles, everyone knows that how it really tastes. Rain can be touched. Yes. We can really feel those rain droplets in our hands. So thus, mountain, incense sticks, trumpet, noodles, rain are what? Concrete nouns. Abstract nouns are actually the opposites of concrete nouns. They can be thought of or felt. They cannot be touched or seen. For, for examples, like in projects, you get a lot of ideas. So that idea is a thought. Happiness is a feeling. Right. So this idea and happiness are abstract nouns. Abstract noun actually refers to qualities actions and state of being so let me be more clear about what are these three things in the very next slide for examples kindness is a quality yes Kindness is really a quality. Not everybody has it. Laughter is an action. Courage is a state of being. Yes. See, this guy is very, it, this guy has the courage to like climb the mountains. Wow. I really want to do these things. This is actually in my bucket list. So in short, abstract nouns are words that name ideas, feelings, experiences, qualities and concepts. So students, there are many abstract nouns that are formed by adding suffixes. I hope that you guys are much clearer with this term suffixes. Let's take an example. Dry. Is a word and we add n e double s ness is a suffixes so when we add these two words it become dryness so dryness is an abstract noun let's take an another example mother and hood hood is a suffix right so when we combine these together we have motherhood so motherhood is actually an abstract noun and then there are some abstract nouns that ends in Y, T, Y or I, T, Y. Example, joy, beauty, responsibility. And then there are some abstract nouns that end in I, O, N, T, I, O, N or A, T, I, O, N. That is collection destruction admiration 